and welcome. This is an overview of the two VIP lounges at Madrid Airport uh, available through Iberia Airlines. This right here is Terminal T4, and this is the Dolly Lounge. The other lounge they have is the Valaquez Lounge, and that's in Terminal T4S. Uh, they're both fairly similar. The one in T4S is a little bit bigger and has a, uh, some sleep suites and a kids play area that is not available uh, in this lounge. Otherwise, they're, they're pretty close. So as you walk through, uh, there's all kinds of uh, seating. It was not too busy. There was several places to sit. All kinds of food, drink, juices, milk, alcohol, sodas, beer, whatever you want. It was all there. And right here, this is the entrance to the shower rooms. I didn't realize you needed a, uh, a code, uh, but they'll give you a little beeper, and when your shower room is available, uh, it beeps, and you go pick up the code from the desk, which uh, I'm going to do here in a second. Shower rooms were uh, really nice. It was great to be able to take a shower uh, after flying on that transatlantic flight, and I had a couple hours uh, in Madrid, so this was uh, very refreshing awesome option to have. They provide everything that you could possibly need if, uh, if things were in your check bags. Uh, everything you need is here. Uh, both the lounges have places to store your bags and included as a place to charge your devices. Uh, they've got an electronic lock. You can put them there, put your bags there, walk around the airport, do whatever you want. Okay, now this is the other lounge. This is the uh, Velasquez Lounge. Uh, this one is in the T4S area in the middle of the duty-free shops. And I forgot to mention the Dolly Lounge is on top of T4. So if you're walking around T4 and looking around then uh, and you can't find it, look up. Uh, that area right there is the kids' play area. Again, this is the... Velasquez Lounge and T4S on the right there. Uh, those are the sleep rooms and the shower rooms. Now when you walk in this lounge, this is going to the right. There's another area that's kind of like a restaurant area and also a buffet area when you walk in and go to the left, which I'll show here in a minute. And this is going to the left uh, when you come out of the entrance. And just a reminder again, uh, it took me a second to find both of these lounges. Uh, this one wasn't too hard to find. This is in T4S, uh, right in the middle of the duty-free shopping area. So it's in the middle of the duty-free store. And then uh, the other one uh, in T4, again, that's on top of all of the gates. So if you're walking around the gates and you, you can't find it, look up. You need to go up before. It's on the same level as a security uh, screening coming from the outside, uh, not security screening coming from T4S, which is below ground uh, on the train that connects T4 and T4S in Madrid.
So anyway, I hope you found this helpful. Uh, help you find these loungers and show you what they're like. Uh, if you get a chance, you're stuck in a layover and you do have access to these lounges, uh, highly recommend it. Great place to relax, charge up, use your computer, get something to eat, drink, or just chill out.